desperately need a new shelter. Richard Hahn is a Las Cruces resident who took his mail-in ballot to the county clerk's office today. He tells me he wanted to make his vote count, especially because he says he's in favor of a new animal shelter. So our, our shelter is a lot, is, is way smaller than, than what, it, what it needs to be. If approved, the GO Bond would pay for over $9 million toward a new shelter and update the administration offices on the existing one. Something Han says he hopes the mail-in ballots will help because people will find it more convenient and actually vote. It was really convenient. It, it, it arrived in the, in the mail. You just filled it out. The instructions were very clear. They were in English and Spanish. Voter turnout is something the county clerk's office is hoping to improve because they say it's been low in the past. Generally, local elections in this area see a turnout of about 10 percent or less. So we're hoping to see an improvement in that number. And keep in mind that if you are a registered voter that lives within the Las Cruces city limits, you have until the 21st of this month to get your ballots mailed or taken into the county clerk's office. For a full list of what you can expect to see on that ballot, you can head to our website, ktsm.com. Reporting live at the Data Center, Jessica Navarro's News Channel 9.